Hello everybody and welcome to our Story and Craft Christmas edition. Today we are going to be reading If You Ever Want to Take a Pirate to Meet Santa, Don't. Alright. This one's by Elise Parsley. If your dad says you're gonna meet Santa, he means you're the bearded guy with a red suit and a bag full of treasures. He does not mean that guy. He's a pirate. He's got a beard just like Santa. If you make friends with a pirate anyway, your dad will tell you that pirates are on the naughty list. You'll tell him it's okay and that you will fix that by the time you meet Santa. You'll teach this pirate not to pillage and plunder or sing loud sea chanties and he won't make anybody walk the plank cross your heart. While you wait to meet Santa, an elf will be handing out candy canes. You'll say, thank you, and nudge the pirate to do the same. He'll say, yarg, and tooth rot. And finally, looks like he's missing a few teeth himself, huh? Finally, thank you. You'll hope he will give those candies back before you meet Santa. Farther up in line, you'll suggest singing to pass the time. The pirate will dive right in with, Oh, a hog eye ship and a hog eye crew, a hog eye mate and a skipper too. He's a real pirate. You'll have to add, and a merry hog eye Christmas to you, and hope he will learn jingle bells by the time you meet Santa. Now the longer you and that pirate wait in line, the more tired and bored and hungry you and that pirate will get. Then, what? Oh, the pirate will pull an egg and cheese sandwich from his bag. You'll remind him that tis the season for giving. He will look at you and look at Santa. Is he gonna keep it or is he gonna give her the sandwich? And then pop that sandwich right down the hatch. <gasps> you will hope you don't starve before you meet Santa. Looks like the pirate only wants to feed himself. Finally, you will get to the front of that line. <laughs> Looks like he pulled out a swordfish and everybody got scared. And meet Santa Claus himself. Things will be going so well. Then the elf behind the camera will ask you to smile nicely and say cheese. Then the elf will tell you, no, smile nicely and say cheese. Because you can tell the pirate is not smiling nicely. He will yell, cheese, no cheese. Then 
He'll holler for you to just give me one good smile already. That's when you'll hear Santa whisper that this is why pirates are on the naughty list. And before you know it, looks like he's showing the pirate the naughty list. And before you know it, Santa will be walking the plank. <laughs> Looks like he's having him walk into a pond, a little fountain. By now, of course, you'll wish you'd have walked right past the bearded guy in a red suit with a bag full of treasures who was really a pirate. By now, you'd rather be stuck in a snowbank than here with this pirate. And before you can even get the pirate to apologize, Santa and his elves will just go home. Well, here's what I would do if I were you. March that scallywag to a chair and put him in time out. Then do not let him move from that seat. Oh, she's gonna be make him be Santa, I'm guessing. Until he changed his scurvy ways. Aww. So sweet. Now he's nice. Ah, uh, never mind. If you want to bring a pirate to meet Santa, don't. After all, pirates are on the naughty list. And what a lovely book, wasn't it? I hope you guys enjoyed it, and we will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.